Hey Zesties, I'm Michelle May and welcome or welcome back to my channel Zesty Girl. As you can tell from the title, this is my first ever Amazon haul. I joined Amazon Prime, I don't know, I don't know, six or seven months ago. So I thought I haven't really ever really looked at Amazon very closely. So I thought, well you know what, I'm just going to have a look. I'm just going to have a look. So there was a whole bunch of random things that I needed. So I decided to search up and see if they were on Amazon and whether they could be delivered the next day, which was today. So I placed this order last night and sure enough, it's three o'clock in the afternoon and it's just arrived on my doorstep. Now I have to say that is pretty exciting. So if you want to unbox this with me, then let's do this. Um, what was I going to say? Oh yes. Okay, but first things first, I bought this top at Costco on my first Costco haul last week. Um, so this is the first time I've tried it on and I love it. I love it. I'll just go back a little bit to show you. It's a v-neck top with buttons and then, and then it has a little tie. Okay, so that's it. And then you just get tied at the waist. Very, very 80s. And then it looks good with jeans. And it's not it's not going to keep popping up really. I can do that. It doesn't really pop up. And they came in um, they came in navy blue and something else I can't remember. Okay, so let's see what's in here. Well, it's well packaged. That's for sure. It's well packaged. Oh wow. Okay. I'm pretty excited about this. Not sure if you're interested. There's lots of things in there. Lots and lots of things. Okay. So it's Sukin. Um I started using Sukin about um, maybe three months ago and I was going to use it for a period of time and then review it and I haven't reviewed it yet but I'm still using it and there's some products I love and I'm, I'm using sort of, I'm using three different ranges including the conditioner and the shampoo and there's some in body wash, I'm using one whole skincare system and I'm using a couple of bits from other skincare systems. So I really need to review that for you, so I'm getting onto that. But in the meantime, I was really keen to try a couple of other products. This here's a revitalizing facial scrub, and it's the first facial scrub I've seen from them. So I do love to have a facial scrub in the shower, so I'm really keen to try this one out. It's like in their signature range, which usually smells like um, lavender, and I really love the scent of the signature range, and that does, that smells amazing. I might try it, and then I might include it in my review that I'm due to do from from Sukin, so there we go. So speaking of Sukin, I have also tried two of the shampoos so far. Uh, one I really, really loved, and the other one I'm not happy with. So I thought before I review them, I might just try the Sensitive Masala shampoo, which is the sense for the sensitive. I've been using the body wash in this and I'm really happy with it. So I thought before I sort of think too much about the shampoo, like I said, one I loved, one I wasn't that happy with, um, I thought I'd try a third one just to get a feeling for it. So this is a sensitive shampoo and that was a really amazing price too. I'll throw up the prices once I edit the video. They also had, this was like $3, this Sukin natural deodorant. To be honest, I was actually expecting this to be like that size for three dollars, but this is a decent size. This is um, 125 mils for three dollars twenty six or something. It was. So I thought I'd love to try this. That smells amazing. It's the signature range again. The scent of the signature range is beautiful. So I'm going to try this and let you know how it goes. Onion flavored rings. I just saw them. I just, I don't know how I saw them. I think I was looking for snacks or something just to see if they had a range of snacks. I only went for things that could be delivered as part of Prime today. So there was a lot of things I couldn't get, but I, yeah, I saw these and I thought, yeah, I have to try those. In fact, my shopping here is so diverse. I was just trying to imagine someone running around trying to shop this big warehouse, trying to put all the things in the box. It was sort of quite intriguing. I'd like to go to that shop. So yeah, so I'll get Tom to try these. 
see what he thinks. Ellie needed this Net Guard Spectra Her Worm and Flea tablets that we give her. This is for a three month lot, so that was a really good price for three months of this. We are really happy with this product because we just find that it does most things in one tablet. And this one's for dogs 15.1 to 30 kilos. And of course it's got a border collier on the front. So I was really pleased to pick this up rather than have to go to the, um, the pet shop. Speaking of pets, I need to get my fish tank organized because we're going to be moving so I need to get it it's it's got a bit of um, algae and things going on so I just felt like I really wanted to give it a really good sort of clean it out clear it out a little bit and um, give it a really good clean and I haven't tried this pristine before so I thought I would try this out in the tank and just see if I can clear up some of the sludgy stuff and some of the algae and that type of thing so get my get my fish tank back in pristine order because I want to get some more fish and um, I won't probably get them before I move but I love my fish tank so much and at the moment it just doesn't look gorgeous so I'll get I thought I'd use this to get it looking much more gorgeous this was so this, this shopping was so much fun so the real reason I wanted to go to Amazon was to see if they had the ashwagandha because I know I knew that a couple of weeks ago I saw the Caruso which is the brand that I love my favorite I saw that it was on there so I was really excited. So, but they weren't able to deliver for a week or so. So I was really surprised when they said they could deliver in one day. I've been using the other brand called Stress Less, which is still Caruso, which is the same uh, company. So this is the Caruso Ashwagandha. I should start at the beginning. This is the Caruso Ashwagandha, which I love so much. I've done about four videos on it, which I will link up here. Ashwagandha, relief symptoms of stress and mild anxiety and just um, uh, just promotes an overall feeling of well-being i shouldn't say especially for women because there's a lot of health benefits and a lot of good benefits for men as well but ashwagandha if you if you're stressed or anxious or or not sleep not sleeping or you need more energy then i totally recommend ashwagandha but i totally recommend you watching the video where i sort of go through exactly what it does um, and how it does it so anyway, that's ashwagandha. I have been, I wasn't able to get this product during lockdown sometimes, so I found ashwagandha in another one of these products. So I've been using that one. But Jessica and I decided the other day, we don't think that it's as good because we just don't feel as good as we do when we're on this one. So that was a long story short. That was a short story long. Um, but yes, we've got, I picked up the ashwagandha and on Amazon, it was half price. This was like $16.99. In stores, it's normally $30. Quite often, I get it from Chemist Warehouse a bit cheaper. But wow. Wow, 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 wow. Um, great price. So I'm going to link to all these things down below if you're interested. I'll put the Amazon links down below. and um, But especially this one because if you want to give this a go, if you want to try this and you watch my video, if you think it's something you want to try, I do highly recommend it. I got these stickers, these thank you stickers. I was just looking for something that I could put onto, um, I'm sending out a lot of product at the moment. So I just wanted something extra to stick on the package. So I saw these and they were really cheap and I thought, oh, that would be nice. You can never thank people enough. So I thought, so let's have a look. I like them because they're sort of natural looking, sort of. So I don't know how many is in here. It's 240 stickers and I, I put up how much I paid for them, but I know it was amazing. It was an amazing price. So thank you stickers for my business. So if you follow my channel, you know that I buy a lot of candles and things and I burn essential oils. And one of, you would also know that one of my favorite scents in the world is sandalwood. Sandalwood also has many health benefits, um, which I don't even know right off the top of my head what they are, but all essential oils help. I love it so much. I don't think I have a plain sandalwood essential oil, so I'm so excited to have got this. It was such a great price as well. If you don't know the scent of sandalwood, I don't know if it's just me that loves it. I just love it. I don't know, I love it. Tempered glass screen protector, packet of two. 
Jessica yelled out to me, if you're shopping on Amazon, can you get me a protect protector for my phone? And I said, sure, so that's for her. So I'm sure that will work fine. I got a new memory card for my camera. The last one I bought, the last one I bought was from Kmart, it's working perfectly well. This is only a small one, it was $11, but I really like this brand and it's the Ultra. I really like it and I got a small 32 gig one because what I want to use it for is I want to use this for what's for dinner. And my thinking is, is to have, is to be able to put this one into my camera when I'm filming the dinners and then just taking it out and then using my camera using my other memory card for everything else I do during the week. But then at the end of the week for what's for dinner, just being able to grab this and download it and just do it really quick and easy. So that's my thinking. Okay. This book, How to Build an Online Business. Australia's top digital disruptors reveal their secrets for launching and growing their online business. I got this book out from the library. I get business books out from the library all the time. Anything to do with business, anything to do with entrepreneurship, anything to do with um, productivity, uh, organization. I just love any of those types of books. This one, it, every so often I find one that I really feel that I want to add to my collection. I have quite an extensive uh, book collection. If I find one that I find is, if I grab one that I find is really useful to me and I want to highlight and I want to go through it and do put stickers in it and mark parts out and do that type of thing I will buy my own copy and so this one was $23 it used to be a lot more expensive it's got covers mindset it covers it's very current it's very current with what's going on so I've just moved my business for the first time into automation um, and I'm having to outsource a lot more so so this has a lot of information about that type of thing like everything it's a really good book and this is more beautiful than I thought it was going to be. Five ingredient slow cooker meals. That's it, by the way. So let's just look at this book. I decided that as much as you can get recipes online, I don't really use recipes that much, as you know, but as much as you can get really great recipes online, I decided that I do love nothing more than a colourful cookbook. And the ones that I have, I, cher I love and cherish. So I really felt that it was time that I got myself another one. I like the idea. I like the idea of five only ingredients. You know me that if you see my what's for dinner, you know that I'm like no frills, super quick and easy, throw it in sort of girl. Um, and the slow cooker is my best friend at the moment, especially because I'm really busy with work. So 100 plus super easy recipes. Now this is by the Australian Woman's Weekly. And I do trust and love them because I've got a few of their cookbooks. So let's have a look at one. It's a really nice quality paper. And can you see? This one is deep pan pepperoni pizza. So there's another one of our favorites at the moment. So I'm really excited about this and I'm going to cook you something from it. I really am. Shredded beef tacos. Apricot chicken, which my children don't like, but I love it. Cauliflower mac and cheese. Yeah, not so much. San Choy Bao, we love that. Hearty ham, hock, hearty ham hock and bean soup. Braised beef with bacon, tomato and onions. Yum. Buffalo chicken wings. Okay, so wish me luck with this baby. Okay, and that's all. And that was all. I'm excited, you know, it's... It's actually really bad, but I really want to go and shop again now. This could be really addictive. Anyway, the reason, the other reason I shopped online too is because I'm really busy and even though I can go back to the stores and shop, do shop with me, I actually haven't had time yet. So hopefully in the next day or so we'll go shopping. I'm trying to balance up whether I'm going to go to Kmart or TK Maxx. I've missed them both. Or Ikea. I don't know which one I've missed more. So I'll have to go and hang out and see. Okay, so thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe to my channel. I really look forward to having you here. And I look forward to seeing you on the next video. See ya. Bye. See ya. Bye. Is it good? Oh, you're recording. Yeah. Oh, I didn't fix my hand in. Hang on. Make sure you... Mm -hmm. I wipe your hands on my robe. Is it good? 
It tastes like cooked lettuce. Cooked lettuce? Yeah. Ah. You know like cooked spinach? Really? It tastes not good. Yeah. You know what I mean. It tastes like that like crock pot vegetable. All this in that big box. So yeah, so what do you what do you give them out of ten? Or, no, they do taste like. Yeah, they taste like. Do you know what they taste like? They layers. taste a bit like a little bit like um, onions and chai, onions and chai yeah. soup. A bit like cup of soup, cup yeah. of chicken. They taste a bit like chicken cup of soup with chives. Yeah. But they're not really. They don't really hit the bad taste buds. They don't really. Yeah. Yeah. They haven't. They're not salty enough, or they're not sort of zabang enough. Zabang. Zabang. Okay. Zabang. 